Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead here on ArcleTexHomepage.com as well as the ArcleTexHomepage.com app. And looking at that pattern, you can see a big upper level trough kind of broad across the northern half of the country. Another disturbance is making its way into the west coast, and this is going to be the system that will bring us a good shot for some rain and lots of it as we close the work week and head into the first half of the weekend. Meantime, next 24 hours not looking too bad as we look at uh, future cast. You can see that tonight. We will see a clear sky across the region during the nighttime hours tonight. Going through your Wednesday, expect lots of sunshine once again across the region. And then going through tomorrow night, clouds will begin to increase across the region as we make our way through the latter stages of your Wednesday night into Thursday morning. We will become cloudy pretty much all day Thursday with a possibility for a few scattered showers, especially across the northwest half of the area for Thursday. Thursday afternoon, Thursday evening. That rain will only increase as we go through the nighttime hours Thursday night. Longer range of future cast showing the rain increasing here going through uh, Thursday night into Friday as we go through especially the afternoon hours Friday. Notice the yellows and the oranges indicating an increase in the intensity of the rain and that increase will only continue as the rain will be heavy at times heading into Friday night. You can see uh, perhaps the heaviest times late Friday night through uh, Friday night into uh, Saturday morning. But then heading into the morning hours we begin with quite a bit of rain but as we go through the day Saturday that rain will likely begin to decrease uh, from west to east. In the meantime tonight with a clear sky another cold night across the area with lows in the upper 20s to low 30s looking at 29 degrees in the Queen, 30 in Texarkana, 32 in Shreveport and 32 also for the nighttime low in Texar in Natchitoches it should say. Daytime high storm will be just a little bit above what we had today as we'll top out in the mid 50s across the region. You can see the 54 in Magnolia, 55 in Shreveport, 55 in Atlanta, and 55 also for the high temperature in Marshall. Here's a look at the weather pattern. You can see that disturbance coming in from the west coast. This system is what's going to bring us that heavy rain, mainly for Friday night. Uh, that will slowly move off towards the east by Saturday afternoon. Most of the heavier rain should be well to the east of the Arkletex. There's still a possibility for some showers to close Saturday. Going through Saturday night, the disturbance moves out. We'll see upper level ridge begin to expand to the east, and that'll shut off the rain for uh, Monday, Tuesday, and sunshine returns. We could close Sunday with a little bit of sunshine, and then we'll be watching this next system on the west coast by Tuesday that could give us another chance of rain towards the end of next week. In the meantime, main concern is going to be a heavy rain here. Not much of a severe weather threat with this big system coming in, but you can see it will drop lots of rain. Uh, models indicating anywhere from two, three, four inches of rainfall possible across all of the Arkletex here, with most of that rain falling late Friday through Friday night into Saturday morning. So all that said, here are the details on what's to expect in the week ahead. Shreveport numbers showing you 55 with sunshine for your Wednesday, low to middle 50s with the clouds for Thursday and Friday, and the rain increases Friday, decreases Saturday morning, and then we will see lots of clouds for Sunday. Again, I think some late day sunshine, a possibility Sunday, and then lots of sunshine for Monday, Tuesday. You see temperatures will stay below normal with highs mainly in the 50s, 40s for Saturday and Sunday. Overnight lows for the most part will be in the 30s and 40s as we'll see a cold night tonight. That cold will likely return behind that big storm system for the first part of next week. In Texas, Canada, temperatures not quite as warm as you'll see highs Friday, Saturday, and Sunday in the 40s. And otherwise, low to middle 50s, the nighttime lows in the 20s and 30s uh, for the most part. When the rain is around, you'll see lows in Texas, Canada, mainly in the lower 40s. So all in all, looks like in one more nice day of sunshine before the clouds move in Thursday and lots of rain invades the Arkletex as we look ahead to Friday, Friday night into Saturday morning.